Hello friends, this is Technotech guys. Today we are going to learn about seismograph. Do you know what is seismograph? It measures the earthquake. So now first we are going to learn about this and second we are going to learn up each part of it and third we are going to check how it's working. Let's come on, we can start it. Hi friends, he's my partner. We are going to explain the project. Okay, now I am going to explain how to make the seismograph. Okay, this is my seismograph. So now I am going to explain this seismograph. I have took a piece of cardboard, a shoe box you can take, shoe box and cut it into a... A box like a shape? A shape of a box and a open place. After that I took a thread and made, I took a cup of plastic plastic bottle I cut it into two pieces and brought the plastic bottle uh, then I then we need some coins to weigh and uh, I bought a pen here for the marking of the Measure. measurement and uh, two sticks so that uh, it, it should so, not uh, so that it, it would shake more so to prevent that I have made two sticks side then we need Asexual tape or gum. After that, I have made two holes this side so that the paper would come. Okay, now I will explain you the seismograph. Now I took a cardboard. After that, I made two holes in the set in the back. I have made two holes. Then I just kept the two two wooden pieces so that to prevent the shaking. And just stick with the glue gun or anything you can use tape or gum, whatever is stronger. And I bought a plastic bottle and make the hole between and two holes in the opposite so that a hole bore the holes to cover with the thread. And I have made a hole in the between in the below to insert the pen so that for the marking. I have took some coins took some coins so that it would weigh it would make some more weight of that and it would help to the measurement and uh, I have just kept a cap in the above so that it would help me because I have made this rope a little bit longer so that if I after measurement when the paper gets over I will just lift it up see I just lift it up to help that Otherwise, it will be difficult to hold it and lift. So, I have kept a cap cap here. So, now we are going to explain. So, now I am going to make, uh, now going to make it work. So, let's, we can start. So, let's start how does it, let's see how does it works. Okay. Uh, so, now we are going to start our project. Okay. Let's see the mission, measurement. Okay, now I'm going to just hold and uh, pull the paper. See, the measurement is not showing. The measurement is not showing because there is no movement. Now I'm going to now I'm going to move and move the seismograph so that we could see the measurement of the earthquake. Okay, let's we can start now. Now my partner will just shake the table or this shake the table, and I'm going to just. Pull the paper. So then we can measure the earthquake. So let's get start. So now we can see that we can measure it. Okay. Now I am going to show you how the measurement has came. So you can see the lines we have measured of earthquake. So now we can do more. Come. I have if I have just uh, made this paper by cutting the papers and just stick it here, just stick it here. So this would help me. If you have any uh, paper like this, this much thickness, which you can use that. And this measurement, which we got from the uh, shaking the table from the pen. Okay, thank you, friends. 
this is how a seismograph works and I am going to send you a link in the, in the description kindly see that link to know more about the earthquake thank you thank you